If you've been following this channel, you know I'm very into picking stocks that are gonna fill your pockets with money. And I've got one that has doubled in price and really caught my attention. I spent an ungodly amount of time researching this one and I think it's the best time to share it with you, my YouTube family. I'm gonna tell you why Plug Power has piqued my interest and why after researching them, I think they're gonna dominate in the long term. So Plug Power designs and manufactures hydrogen fuel cell systems that replace conventional batteries in equipment and vehicles powered by electricity. This one is basically a clean energy juggernaut that is emerging and doing so quickly, just like our YouTube family's pockets. In this video, I will discuss how Plug is positioning itself in the industry, what their products are, who their customers are, and what price target I think this one is going to hit in the near future. What's going on everyone? My name's Henry, welcome back to my channel. If you wanna learn from a dude that worked on Wall Street and Goldman Sachs about stock market investing, well, you found the right channel. Make sure you subscribe for weekly finance videos that will load your pockets with money. I'm honestly aiming for videos every other day, so I'm busting my butt, and even on the 4th of July, I'm making this video because I love you guys, and I wanna help y'all make money. I'm not from the South, but I like saying y'all, y'all. Plus, we have fun here, so join the fam. Oh, and you guys, I gotta mention, the only problem with this channel, the subscribe button keeps getting pissed at the like button, so make sure you hit both. I'm tired of the bickering between those two. I have a message at the end of my video, and I just wanna say, if you don't make it that far, I am so grateful and so thankful for all the subscribers. I'll probably have over a thousand subscribers before I post this, but I promise, no matter how many subs I have, I will always make honest content I believe in and think can help my audience benefit. I'm giving away my seven years of knowledge because it makes me so happy to have a positive impact in your guys' lives and I love getting all of your comments. So let's discuss Plug Power Business and what they are doing. Here's a very short clip of the hydrogen economy. Hydrogen has the potential to develop $2.5 trillion worth of business and more than 30 million jobs by 2050. At Plug Power, we recognize hydrogen as a fuel, not an industrial gas. We'll continue to invest in new innovations on a path to green and sustainable gas and ensure cost competitive fuel is available. The first thing that stood out to me is their long-term vision on hydrogen as an energy source. We know alternative fuel is going to dominate the future, but which type of fuel? Well, there's gonna be a number of types of alternatives. Hydrogen fuel cells are one of the fastest growing markets for innovative companies like Plug Power. Here's what else I like about the company. They have chosen a very good niche. I am absolutely in love with their niche because it's really hard to compete in a sea of electric vehicles, which Tesla is monopolizing, as well as other EV makers like Neo. Drop a comment if you want a Neo video. Plug is making money by selling specialty hydrogen fuel cell vehicles, mostly forklifts in the niche market like warehouses, but Plug also services the machines and delivers the liquid hydrogen fuel on which they run on. Its revenue has skyrocketed over the past three years, up nearly 200%. Wait guys, look what I found. You know how I said they have a niche market in warehouses? Well, who other than Amazon noticed Plug and Mr. Bezos who just couldn't help himself invested in them. This article is one year old, but that doesn't change anything. Amazon isn't a day trader looking to get in and out. Everything Amazon does is a long-term bet. I mean, Jeff Bezos is arguably the best investor of all time. So the deal allows for the fuel cell company to grant Amazon warrants to buy up to 55.3 million shares or around one quarter of the company's outstanding shares. In addition, Amazon committed to purchase up to 70 million of Plug Power's fuel cell products for use in its enormous warehouses and distribution centers. I don't know what I like better, that Amazon saw an investment opportunity in Plug or that they wanna do business with them. That's a hard choice. Almost as hard as smashing that like button. I think they wanna work with Plug to improve their efficiency. I mean, Amazon has invested heavily in its fulfillment centers, allowing Amazon Prime members to receive guaranteed two-day shipping. This move is meant to drive orders and keep people buying online rather than going to a convenience store or another brick and mortar store like Walmart or Target. Funny how convenience stores are no longer so convenient when Amazon steps in the picture, huh? That's called innovation. Guys, since e-commerce is dominating, 
especially during our times of work from home, quarantine. I think being involved with Amazon's supplier in this case is a very smart move, not to mention the other stuff you guys are not gonna wanna miss out later in this video about plug power. One last thing I promise about Amazon because I think their investment also has something to do with the company's stated goal of entering the logistics market. Currently, Amazon relies on the third-party shippers such as FedEx and UPS to deliver its items, and they have an announced a number of strategies including autonomous delivery drones, but also getting into the traditional logistics business and fuel cells going back to plug may provide a cheaper and more efficient alternative to gasoline or diesel. Did I say delivery drones? What is this workhorse? Just check out my playlist if you're a new subscriber. For those of you who saw that video, what are your thoughts? Is Amazon and Plug going to have their own drone delivery service soon? Let's move on and talk a little more about their specific products and go from the macro view to the micro view. Plug is making more revenue because hydrogen fuel cells have proven to be a good energy choice for powering forklifts. Gen Fuel is one of Plug Power's products and holy hydrogen power. When I saw this, I'm like, whoa, dude, that looks fun. Here's a video. So here's the three components involved, which I got directly from their website. Plug Power provides delivery to customer sites based on customer use. On average, it looks like they go through two to 300 kilograms of hydrogen a day. And just to put that in perspective, I'm about 80 kilograms. So this is between three and four times my weight. I love how they just say right there, we leverage quantity buying power to ensure favorable cost. Looks like they have someone working there that went to business school. The other part of this is hydrogen storage and station and cabinets. And pretty self-explanatory, it's the thing that holds the hydrogen kind of like a gas station stand. I'm gonna quickly talk about the gen drive, which is the fuel cells themselves. This is the superior alternative and unique technology that actually stores the energy and replaces the industrial lead acid batteries in electric class one, two, and three material handling equipment. I like how they function perfectly fine in freezer environments as low as negative 22 Fahrenheit. Can you imagine everything is good and all of a sudden your forklift just stops working because a lot of these warehouses are super cold? Well, it looks like plug power has that covered. The next point is battery changing requires 15 minutes per shift compared to two minutes for hydrogen refueling. So over a year, that 13 minute per shift saved represents over 234 hours of lost productivity per forklift truck in a three shift operation according to them. So basically, I think Amazon warehouse workers make about $15 per hour. So 234 hours times $15 an hour is $3,500. That's not a bad cost savings on top of these benefits, which basically the one I'm paying attention to is just the benefit the company receives by having its workers be more productive. So Henry, why is this stock more than doubled from $4.17 about a month ago to over $9 in one month. That's because Plug Power boosts its 2024 revenue target to 1.2 billion and they stated they see increased profitability. The best part about a growing business is they see economies of scale. Here's a little image of what economies of scale is. I'm gonna give you the 30 second rundown of my business degree with an example. As firms produce higher quantities of goods, they can cover their costs more easily. If you run a small hospital having a doctor who earns 300,000 see 
each patient individually, it's really expensive. But now let's say it's New York City and you have a lot of patients. You can have a one doctor be the head doctor and 10 physician assistants and nurses taking care of their patients under the doctor's supervision. Now the hospital can treat more patients and the average price for seeing each patient actually goes down. This is better for the patient and for the hospital. If you want to see more economics like this, I'm thinking about making videos on what I learned in business school. If you guys are interested, just let me know in the comment section. Okay, back to plug power growing business and economies of scale. I'll give you another reason the stock has shot up and may continue to do so. They recently had two acquisitions, United Hydrogen Group and Engineer ELX. I do not know if I pronounced that right. According to management, these two transactions have further enhanced Plug Power's position in the hydrogen industry with capabilities in generation, liquefaction, and distribution of hydrogen fuel complementing its industry-leading positions in the design, construction, and operation of customer-facing hydrogen fuel stations. That was a mouthful, but basically, I'm going to break it down for you. These guys have a growth mindset and are acquiring other companies, and Wall Street is loving it. I I should have just said that to begin with. United Hydrogen acquisition is meant to improve its hydrogen sales margin and having healthy margins is super important and goes back to having a scalable business we mentioned earlier. Okay, now we are going to discuss what should our investing fam do with this information. I've done hours and hours of research to save you the hassle and I've determined this one has a bright future. However, I've looked into their history and they seem to be burning a lot of cash very quickly and have fallen short of expectations a few times. The biggest risk that I see is that they have a lot of debt, which I don't love, but I also get that they need money to grow. So this is another speculative stock that has tons of potential if things go right. I am waiting for more tangible results, but me personally, I'm going to be selling a put at the eight strike, which basically means that I'm committed to buying 100 shares of the stock at $8 if it goes to that point. I also will collect money for entering that position. Basically, I see this as a win-win because I'd like to own the stock for $8. I may also buy a few shares. On my Patreon page, I post weekly trades and I'm going to get way more involved with explaining how options work and what I do so you guys can follow my stock moves I am making so you guys can track. And since these videos take a whole lot of time, I wanna get that information out to you as soon as possible so you guys can benefit. Either way though, I'll be making a lot more of these videos and I love sharing my knowledge. I am so glad the five years I spend continuing learning about finance in university working for Goldman Sachs and a number of investment firms is being put to use and I can help others achieve better results in their investing and financial lives if you guys have any special requests please comment below I read and try to respond to all your comments if you're still watching thank you for being awesome and the channel has probably reached 1,000 subscribers as of July 4th that literally gives chills throughout my body it's truly amazing and I am so grateful and thankful for your support my promise to you is I will always be honest and dish out content I believe in and I think can benefit my audience seriously I've I'm, I'm almost feeling like crying because I mean I've been doing this for such a long time and I do well financially and I have been investing for many years, but seeing the impact that I have and the positive comments truly makes me want to keep making these videos for you. I'm going to cut it there. I'll be back with another video that's going to fill my brothers and sisters pockets with lots of dough. Don't forget, invest safe.